What up, peeps? KJ Drift is in the building, and I am back with some more Last of Us Part 2 information. And we're going to be talking about a little bit of the controversy about the Last of Us Part 2. And the controversy topic is about the violence that's in within Last of Us Part 2. And I've been reading upon a new article that just been released about five hours ago, and it's been a big talk about the violence in the game. I guess it's been a big controversial thing. And as we got, and everybody knows, as we know, about a couple, several months ago, probably about two months ago, Naughty Dog had released the very first gameplay trailer of the Last of Us Part 2. And I got honestly say it was pretty brutal i mean from what the article is saying i don't think it's brutal as people made it seem because me personally i love gore i love violence and i think that's what's going to make the last of us stand out more because the last of us is a realistic realistic type of game and it shows what will happen in the real world if an outbreak or something like this will happen because it will get dark it will get brutal and it'll just get all over the place but i came across an article and supposedly it's supposed to be a big controversy about it but without further ado i'm going to jump straight into the article for you guys so according to Haley gross the co-writer of the last was part two naughty dog has attempted to make the forthcoming title about the cycle nature of violence with the idea being that violence begets violence begets violence which is an ex- exhibited in how it affects ellie throughout the game as a sort of growing trauma the sequel's director the naughty dog vice president Neil Druckmann, added that the studio isn't attempting to use violence to, to serve its gameplay in a fun way quote unquote but more so to create engaging moments for the players to take part in Druckmann went on to say that naughty dogs enthusiast aesthetic <laughs> approach to violence is to make it as grounded and real as possible with the last of us part two use such an extremely gory acts being an ends to the means which should make quote unquote make you uneasy to move forward at times but willing to do so so due to the story and the characters being so captivating the director also said it that he hoped players will would be reflecting on the actions that they're taking part in as the plot progresses and i feel like this is extremely, extremely interesting because not only is, you know, the game is going to be brutal, obviously, but it shows that the story is going to be very, very immersive and v- just get you, grasp, just grasp you into the thing to make you understand what's going on. And I really like that because Neil Druckmann is trying to capture that, you know, that feel of of having you, how would you feel about yourself if you're literally doing this? But I do believe that it's a little bit of a, a drag. I mean, I personally think that the violence is what makes the game pretty good. I mean, obviously not the main thing because, you know, it's a violent video game, obviously. But, I mean, it's just, it's the characters, it's the story, it's everything else. But I do believe that it shows a great, it gives a great depiction of how real life will actually be if it was an outbreak or something like that of everybody fighting for survival. But personally, I think this is really, really interesting and I really cannot wait because because as we all know, the main theme is revenge. And the whole story the whole story is going to be depressing. And I just cannot wait because, you know, Naughty Dog will know, knows how to bring that feel to the table. But I'm excited to see what they're going to bring to the table. And like, like I said, me personally, I don't think the gore is going to affect me a lot. I mean, it won't affect me at all because, like I said, I'm a fan of gore. I play gory games in general. But the first last was was gory. But probably not as gory as this one might be. But it was still disturbing and gory and it still had you feeling down. But let me guys comment below and, let me, and tell me what you guys think do you guys think the game is too violent do you guys want it to be too violent do you think uh, the game is really over the top on gory or do you just think that the game is doing what it's supposed to do to depict the realistic aspect of what can happen if a real outbreak happened uh, just let me guys uh, i think this is a very very interesting topic but let me let me know what you guys think i hope you guys enjoyed this video uh, give the video a big thumbs up, subscribe if you have not already. More great Last of Us videos is coming soon. I, w- I am going to be bringing some Last of Us gameplay for you guys, so I hope you guys stay tuned with that. But I, c- I just can't wait. More great, dope videos coming soon. I hope you guys enjoy it. I'll see you guys in the next one, and I'm out.